of the 10 decades, you know, it'd be difficult to pick one particular one because I've enjoyed every one of them. Today it's just out of out of proportion to what it was uh, back in those early days. Y'all didn't have to worry about the face masks. Didn't, now, didn't know what they were. You know. <laughs> I lost two teeth be, be, because I didn't have a face mask. We had a floor mat, I mean a gym mat, and a couple of dumbbells. It's changed a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it, it has changed a bit. How much you weigh? 265. Uh, and what do you want? 245. Uh, man, I tell you, we had we had maybe uh, three or four that weighed over 200 pounds. <laughs> so it's an entirely different game today. Yeah, the field's yeah. the same width. The field's the same length. We got goal posts, but that's about the only thing. That <laughs> and this year uh, represents the 80th consecutive year that I have attended one or more UT football games. When I went to work for Humble Oil and Refining Company, Humble used to advertise, come to work for Humble and make it a lifetime career, and that's what I did. And we've had a wonderful life together all these years and uh, just hope to continue for a while longer. It's been one of the best things about Longhorn Village because he's such, both of them are such outstanding people. Uh, and I'm sure she's been behind all of it and she obviously took good care of him and fed him well. He walks three miles, I think it is, every morning of the world that is sharper than we are that are 20 years younger than he is. Texas hold them high. Hold them high. Happy to see somebody that can be 100 years old and be as active and, and as energetic as John is. And I asked John one time what he attributes his long life to, and he said, no kids. I wish I could do that. John is out walking every single morning around this facility and I say if John could do it at the age of 99 I gotta get my butt out there and ride and walk too. I've been walking for over 50 years so it's just a habit. If I don't walk I don't feel like I started the day right. I'm just glad that uh, he is as still as active as he is and um, he's a good role model for all of us. Continue to be active and don't sit in the easy chair and, and a rocking chair. I've seen some of my friends who retired and that they took the opportunity to take life easy and they're not here today. So I've, I've tried to keep active and, uh, and that's why I guess I'm, I'm still able to, to take life and enjoy life. He's just a fine gentleman in all aspects of life. And I would like to be following his footsteps. He was well. His attitude is like, like he was 50 instead of 99. It motivates me to think that he has the energy and interest he does in everything that goes on here at Longhorn Village. <laughs> I'm fortunate in one way. I've, I've had pretty good health throughout the hundred years, and uh, and I appreciate all the new friends that I've made here at uh, Longhorn Village. And as I said earlier, uh, it just seems like they're old friends that I've known a long time, 
rather than new friends. And uh, because everybody seems to pull together and enjoy the life together. <laughs> we can all strive for them, but uh, I better, I better have it all. the next one that, that's 100 out here, we'll have the same party for them. <laughs> Audio Jungle.